Yeah, yeah, what's up, my dear? So what's going on, man? You asked the phone, uh, you're not catching it. What's the problem? Why are you rooted here? Dry bones. That's all I see. What do you mean dry bones? Dry bones. Dry asses. Dry. What you looking at? Who is she? Oh! The lady in red! Who is she? Hey! Oh! Hey. Follow my gaze! Merida! <laughs> nah, 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 nah! Why are you laughing? What do you say her name is? Rita. Oh. Well, well, um, I didn't mean to be disrespectful, my friend. But you see, that girl. I have this hunch that you are going to talk to her. I don't know how. How do you mean? Marida is the most sophisticated lady that has ever stepped foot in this club. Top notch. Read my lips. Top notch. Sophisticated. Oh, yeah. I Who is she? That. Well, um. Okay. Um. Who is she? I don't know, but I. I know she stepped in in this club a few months ago. Mm. Yeah, and she's different from all the girls I have seen here. Top notch. I like top notch. <laughs> so what do you mean? The reader is a no. That would be a bit difficult. Trust me. I'll deal with the difficulties. Hey, for real? Anywhere around the palace. There's nowhere in this palace. Only the gods know where he got to. Where he went to. At this ungodly hour of the night. And Obieza. Obieza who is supposed to give account of his whereabouts is so so nowhere to be found. This suggests that they're both in this together. Obieza. Yes, I will have your head on a stake for daring to disobey my instructions. If anything happens to my son, Father. Nothing will happen to him. He came as an adult. And I believe the God will guide him wherever he is. I need to go to bed now.
Lonely? What will make an awesome beauty? Sit alone in a crowded club. What was that supposed to mean? Baby, baby. A compliment or an insult? I meant no insult. Baby, baby. That was my only two way of asking if you. If you were lonely. Alone. Do you want to be my bodyguard? More than that. A guiding angel, perhaps. What do you say? Oblige me. Let's go back to my table and now though. Put your bill for tonight. Everything. Well, you sound interesting. I am interesting. Oh. <laughs> and your choice of words, they are amazing. So, Adam, take that as a yes. Are you out of your mind, Obiaze? I want you and the prince back in this palace before this battle I spat on the ground dries up. No excuses. This is an order. Where did they say they are? Well, I must say you are a very interesting gentleman. Right. <laughs> Thanks. But this night could, um, could be more interesting. Hmm. Really? Really? <laughs> you are making me very curious right now. How do you intend to do that? Free your mind. Let it go. Explore. Hmm. Here he goes again. Explore. I love that word. <laughs> so. Is it going to be what's my why? Do you know him? Oh, yeah. I, um, I, I came with him. One minute, please. What is the meaning of this? He, he just interrupted something. Hey, lover boy. That's a problem. What problem? The king just called. He wants us home now. The king? Yeah. How? How? I'm not a kid. And where the hell is your phone not switched off? Hey, come on. I'm into on my phone because I'm meant to get a call from home. <sighs> but then, um, take a chill pill. I know what to do. Right? I'll go back home. Tell him that, um... Yeah. I, I didn't see you. I mean, I don't know where right, you are. Right, right, right. You do that because I have no plans of coming home tonight. All right? I still have some unfinished business. Uh, I'll see you in the morning. Run that along. Was, that was fast, though. Yeah. I run along. Now. Be careful. Be as you run along. I will. was bored so he asked me to take him out oh. and you did without permission I'm sorry your highness that was an oversight call 
insult to the throne of Ugunta and oversight. Where is Ikem? What sacrilege are you vomiting? You went out with the prince from this palace, now you're back to the same palace without him. Yes, your highness. He left before me. I, I searched everywhere for him. You searched? Why have you returned without him? Father, he may be saying the truth. You know your son, Ikem. He can be impossible sometimes. Smart. Out. Out through that door. Come back here. Now you move. Go back to wherever you, you get him. Don't return to this palace without him. Do I make myself clear? Now come again. I said you do not return anywhere around this palace except you are with the prince. Get out! What are you still doing here? Where is he? Where is my brother? Because I knew you were lying to father. Speak, else I will have no option than to report you to father. Why not be your brother's keeper and allow this matter to slide, my princess? Do not patronize me, Obiese. Where is Ikeme Funa? Do not force me to return to father, because you know the outcome. No one exists without little secrets. Secrets that we never wanted shared with people. Especially people that hold us to very high esteem. Why not be a good little girl and allow your brother to have a good time to himself? Or do you prefer we go to talk to your father, the king? Go to bed, good girl, catch some sleep. I will be right back.
scared me. I'm sorry, I didn't mean to. Just that I couldn't take my eyes off the goddess you have behind you. Stop, stop. Someone might see us. I want you in my room tonight. No excuses. When the entire palace must have gone to bed. I, I, I don't think I can... Else, the king will hear of your dirty activities with the princess. So tonight in my room, I will not take no for an answer. Else, your entire life in this palace will be miserable. Why are you this wicked? Why can't you let that poor girl be? What has she done to you? You can keep me at all, ignore me for all I care. But read my lips. I will not allow you to take advantage of that innocent girl with your cheap blackmail. You see, I used to think you're wise. But now I know otherwise. Why can't you just allow me have a feel of the goodness she's endowed with by God? Are you this selfish? Stay away from her. She's not yours. <laughs> Is that what you think? I know for real, is that what you think? Why can't you just be a good girl and allow this slide? Because you cannot stand on the way of a tide that will surely blow you away. Or do you prefer I talk to your father, the king? I mean to tell him of the activities the other day with she and your friend. And who would believe you? It's your word against mine. <laughs> oh my God. Who will believe me? <laughs> okay then. Let me show you a little video that might interest you. Who will believe me? There you go. Oh, not so fast, my princess. Not so fast. I will advise you. Stay cool and allow me to take what is mine. Get up. Blow, 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 blow. Blow, 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 Eo, 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 Eo,
Is there any other thing we can do for you, my prince? No, no. Thanks, you my girl. So... You haven't said anything about your dish. How was the experience? Merida. She was the bomb. She was. Um, I just wonder where she is now, what she's doing. Yeah. Well, um, she was a good lay. Every other thing doesn't matter. I guess so. You know, in as much as I cherish what we had last night, for some awkward reason, I don't, I don't think I want to see her again. Why? I don't know. This, this, uneasy feeling about her presence, I, I can't place it, but, but something about her doesn't just sit well. Well, whatever. The video has been done. Life goes on. Um, get me a plate of fruit. And be fast about it. Easy. Hey, sis. Greetings, my friends. I can see that someone is um, still ha angry with me. Can I sit? If you feel like. Say whatever you want to say and leave. As you can see, I was busy before you came. Um, Adoma, I get it. You're angry because I, I didn't let you in on my 
Where about last night? I'm sorry. I honestly didn't mean to keep you in the dark. I didn't mean it. I wouldn't do it again. It's not about you. What is it about? It's about Obiese. Obiese? What about Obiese? Be very careful. It doesn't mean well for you. She is not happy with you. You have to be careful with her. Why are you telling me this? I thought she is your lover. I am not a lesbian. I don't do women. She and her friend forced me into what she saw. I tried to resist. But she threatens to send me away from the palace. I am an orphan. And I cannot stand the thought of being homeless. Because I cannot return to my father's compound. My uncle has sworn to kill me if he ever sets his eyes on me again. <laughs> Listen. No one is going to send you away from this palace. As long as you promise to remain mine. I promise. <laughs> no, no, honestly, I just... Um, but I didn't know it was going to happen like that if you asked me. Sometimes. Right? <laughs> that reminds me of um, heading to Abuja tomorrow. Evelyn is um, due for the country this weekend. Wow. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I can't wait to see her. I mean, after a long time. Are you telling me? It's been a while. I miss her so much. Oh. Honestly, I cannot wait for this marriage and coronation to be over. Right. So that I can move on to more personal things. Personal things? Yeah. What could be more personal than dedicating yourself to your wife and um, you know trying to be better for your kingdom it'll be there are more pressing things than the throne this throne I, I like to pursue my career and you know living a life that Why do you look like you just saw a ghost? Are you shocked to see me? Merida, what, what are you doing here? I cannot remember telling you my address, where I'm from or where I live or who I am and um, how come you, you're here? How did you find mm. me? Too many questions. You should be concerned about why I am here and not how I got here. Remember you're a goldfish and a goldfish has no hiding place. Mm. So, why are you here? What is that? Just take it. Open it. Oh, it's no letter bomb.
What is the meaning of this? This has got to be the biggest joke of the century. Do I look like a joker to you? Didn't you read the letter? Whatever you read there, that's what it is. And, and you expect me to believe that, right? Okay, let's say that what you say is true. You're pregnant. <laughs> it could be anyone's baby. Prince of Ubunta Kingdom, I do not sleep around. I am pregnant and it is yours. <laughs> I know your type. You want to reap where you did not sow. You want me to raise another man's bastard. Right. Well, newsflash. I am the crown prince of this kingdom. And no one, I mean no one, messes with me and goes scot-free. Try. You know what? I am not here to banter words with you. I am open for a DNA test. So whenever you're ready for one, contact me. My number is on that letter you just threw on the floor. What happened? What does she want? Is everything all right? I swear by everything I hold sacred. I wasn't avoiding you. I was only busy with... Busy, you said. In this palace. The maid did not attend to my needs for some time now. I know it must be him. Obieze. Lips may not be able to say what I will do to you if you continue to stand on my path of happiness. You may leave. Thank you, my princess. So this is it. I felt it. I knew there was something coming, but I didn't think it was going to come in this form. I took a chill pill. I believe she's obviously after money. But then, why didn't you play safe? Why? I don't know. Obi, I have no idea what came over me that night. I just, I just wanted to be free and have some fun for, for once. I acted as if I was under some form of enchantment. I, I don't know. What do we do? Well, I'm just 
or do something, all right? You didn't commit uh, much crime. You got her pregnant, you didn't kill anyone. You're making this even sound worse. Who is she? What does she want? The prince looks obviously worried. What could be the content of that envelope that makes the prince look this worried? We must meet with her tonight. In clear terms, I want to know her stand. But I can bet my life, she is in for the money. Trust me. Money. Yes, money. Obiense. I sincerely hope that's all she wants. Money. How oh, did I get myself into this mess? Hey man, take a chill pill. I, I got this on lockdown. I have practically searched for you all over the palace. What are you doing here all to yourself? Um, <clears throat> I just needed to clear my head. Um, yeah, but I'm, I'm fine. My prince, you are like an open book to me. I am your only sister and I have known you for years. I know when you are troubled. So tell me, what troubles your spirit? Or is it that lady that came here earlier today? No. It has nothing to do with her. I just had a little business issue I needed to sort out. But it's sorted now. You have nothing to worry about. I know you care about me. Um, but it's nothing. I have said it. If you say so, just be careful. Blue, 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 it is obvious you don't want to share whatever is bothering you with me. No matter how hard you try to pretend that all is well, I know something is wrong. But you prefer to deal with it with the help of Opieze than me, your sister. There's... There is nothing bothering me. Nothing I cannot handle. Besides you, you refer to Obieze as though he is a stranger. Forgetting that he is family too. He is our cousin. Well, if you say so, I just want you to be careful.
<laughs> I have not seen anything yet. Are you serious? <laughs> Thank you, Hannes. <laughs> You. The priest is back. Yes, yes, yes. he's back. Baba. Oh. Oh. Dad. Oh yeah. Come on. Let me look at you. That's beautiful. Good in your eyes. Ah. Yes. She's, isn't she pretty? Mm -hmm. uh, yeah, absolutely. Hey, son! Yeah, son! Uh, <laughs> Good to see you again. Yeah. yeah! Welcome back from the journey. Come on! Thank you. Thank you, Father. My daughter. We have actually waited for you. Hmm? We thank the gods. This is of course the kingdom of the kingdom, eh? where you are going to be made to be very very Thank you. Welcome once. Yeah, I am very happy. Heir apparent to the throne of Ubuntu Kingdom, Donald Ikemevna Ikemba, hmm? my lovely son. Uh, my friends, you are welcome. Thank you. Um, well, no dull moments now. Because it's going to be um, celebration galore. Excuse me. Huh? Yes. seem to be happy out there. Why did you leave that way? I don't know, but I'm, I'm just fine. I, I'm feeling feverish. Oh, I'm sorry. I think you're just probably tired from me, from the trip. I should um, take you to the room. Father's mistress. Do you know her before? No, no of course not. Why do you ask? Um, uh, nothing. Um, I was only... It's fine, it's fine. You're, you're tired, I'm sure. Let's, let's go to your room. Father, I know you to be a careful man. This, this woman, do you even know her? Where she's from, what she does. She could be dangerous. Enough! I said, enough! Now I know enough of her to know that she is harmless. Completely harmless. Avalanche in the sea. Confirmed that she is spotless. And who the gods have said yes to? Who are you to say no to? You, Father, it doesn't sound like it's you talking. Father, you have taught me that all that glitters is not gold. I think there's more to that woman that, that missed the eye.
Jim, why are you pushing this matter this far? Why? Huh? By the way, let me ask you. Did you know this young woman before now? I knew her before. Does not matter. Right now, I have this uneasy feeling about her father. You can. I think you're tired and you need rest, long one. Hmm? There is nothing wrong with my mistress. Absolutely nothing. Okay? She's a good woman. A good young woman. And I'm sure that with time, you'll get to like her. That I promise you. That doesn't still explain the fact that you couldn't put a call across to me. My father, our father, took a mistress and you didn't deem it fit to call me. Come on, you know better than this. I know you had my back. Bearing in mind that you've seen that lady here before. Now you want to blame me. I thought you said nothing was wrong. I thought you said it was just a little business issues to take care of. So why are you suddenly trying to bust a vein? Seeing her around father. Hmm? That still doesn't change anything. It doesn't. Why should I even bother calling you? When I am never even consulted before any decision is taken in this palace. How do I even know? If it's not an arrangement, courtesy of you and OBSA, how do I? Stop sounding ridiculous. Stop it. Yes, I apologize for not letting you in on all this initially, but that's not enough reason for you to do what you did. I heard voices. Is everything alright? Absolutely, everything is fine. I was just, um, just trying to sort out some things with my sister. It is okay. I will be waiting in the room. Um, I'll come over to the room soon. <laughs> we have a whole lot to chase about. I can't wait. I have missed your stories a lot. Temperature. You need to rest. Okay? I will be fine. Where did she come from? Who? Your father's mistress. Have you met her before? Why this sudden curiosity, babe? Are you sure you're alright? I don't think I like her. I have this uneasy feeling about her presence in this palace. The manner in which she look at you. I just think everything is not alright. Why would you even think that, babe? Why in the world would I know her? I don't know her from anywhere. Why would you think that? I don't even know what I'm talking. Yeah, that's fine, I... babe. It's, it's okay. If you know what, 
to not worry your head about it. Okay? I'm sure you're just stressed and jet lagged. The whole journey is making you stressed. So what you need to do right now is rest. Okay? I'm sure when you wake up in the morning, you'll be all right. Just be careful, darling. I love and don't want to lose you. You wouldn't lose me. Now rest. Hey, boo. Are you scared to see me? What do you want from me? Kim, why are you so impossible? Take things easy. We are friends, remember? Moreover, our baby gets to feel the warmth of his father. What are you up to? Listen to me. Whatever plans, whatever gimmicks, whatever scheme, you think you have. You see in this palace? It wouldn't work. Take it elsewhere. You are so stubborn and arrogant. I don't know why you're busting a blood vessel over something you're supposed to be cool and taking advantage of. Just take it easy. Remember we're family now. You've got no choice. <laughs> oh, these arms. I miss them around me. Don't worry, no one is seeing us. I miss your whole body. Down the depth of my thing. See, baby. Maybe let's take advantage. Let's create those scenes again. Come on. Hey, hey, Where you think you are? Where? Hmm. Merida, or whatever you call yourself. This is not a brothel. Hey, wake up. Look around you. This is a palace made for royalty. Now, if you want your stay here to last, you need to comport yourself. Stay away from me. My darling, and baby, don't keep me waiting. What does she want? So you knew she was here? What, what is she doing here? I just saw her the way you did. You just saw her the way I did? Obieza, you saw her in the palace and you didn't deem it necessary to put a call through to me. Why didn't you call me? Come on, just take a chill pill. Don't work yourself up for nothing. Like I said, I just saw her the way you did. I cannot start telling you right there at the airport. Besides, Eve might suspect something fishy. I can't believe this. 
What does that good for nothing harlot want from me? What does she want from me? Well, I suggest you talk to the king. Who knows? Maybe you digged it real hard, you know. <laughs> I'm sorry. This, this is just all messed up. I have spoken to my father. I tried to convince him to to let her go, but he's hell bent on keeping her. Wow, that's a little problem, though. I was actually wondering where you entered. Oh, I went to check on the royal maidens. Maidens? Oh, uh, come yes. on. You don't need to bother with that. Obiaza will do that. If you say so. Yes. Um, you are not supposed to be here. Where am I supposed to be? Hmm. Well, yes. you are supposed to be somewhere close to paradise. Oh, mm. Paradise? And where is paradise? Well, let me show you where paradise is. Mm. Come with me. It was just uh, a nightmare. You want to talk about it? No. Are you sure? No. Okay, uh, it's okay. It's okay. Relax. Come. Come. It's okay, man. I'm here with you, baby. Nothing. Nothing can hurt you or hurt me, alright? I just knew this whole thing was going to end up like this. It's freaking me out. This is really serious. I saw this coming. My father is talking about getting married to her. Making her his wife. Wow. He looked me straight in the face and said that's why. On a real, this is really serious. What does she want? What is she doing here? Yo, 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 y